Hey everyone, I wanted to hop on here and talk about accessibility for a minute. I, in my personal opinion, I think, I mean, I wouldn't say Airbnbs, but like condos in Florida, their showers are like wheelchair accessible, but like, I feel like not so much in condos, but especially in hotels. Accessibility to someone in a hotel is more different to someone in a wheelchair. Because what I mean about accessibility to someone in a hotel is a bench in a shower and with my disability I can't with my type of cerebral palsy I can't sit up on my own so I would I need like a shower chair or like a a manual chair to help me shower and do all my like personal care but um so when we go on vacation we improvise and we take my manual chair and like I said in previous videos my mom just like rinses me off with my bathing suit on in the shower with my main old chair because there there's so many different like definitions of of accessibility um that unless you're living it I don't think people understand like what your needs are kind of thing and that's okay too but I I think accessibility is different for everybody it depends on your needs and stuff but like I said my family and myself we always like improvise and do best what works for us and 100% of the time I'm gonna be in the pool so like with my swimming and stuff and um so, but it's just interesting when you go to like different places and different, how do I say this? Like different places are accessible, but it's accessible in different ways, if that makes sense. But, um, I wanted to thank my brother actually if he watches this channel thank you connor for renting the beach chair for the week i'm looking forward to walking on the beach with my family and um and um doing all the things but i, I want to make this clear I will definitely be poolside all week because, like, the ocean is a little questionable, um, so, but I'll be, like, laying on the beach every week, too, so I'll be doing a little bit of both, um. But I'm really looking forward to just hanging out with my family and spending time with them. Because we haven't really been on a family vacation since my first niece was born. And it was like in, I don't know, I can't even remember. It's been way too long since our family has been on a vacation together. So... I probably won't be vlogging very much on vacation, but just to give you a heads up guys, 
Um, I probably won't be vlogging for a while in general because we're leaving for vacation and then after I get back from vacation I'm home for one day and then I leave for camp so I'm going to be busy um, the next couple of days but like subscribe and if you guys have any questions or ideas for the vlog let me know in the comments below and I will see you guys later. Alright.